He was like, do y'all know what y'all just did? Y'all, y'all went over the chain and said no trespass. You can't trespass. <laughs>
anyways so this is the time <sighs> yeah so i almost got arrested and i was in eighth grade i believe it was like 13 or 14 and um i was hanging out with my best friend okay so let me say this time me and my best friend we always go to this one mall that's here where we live and we always go there like all the time and let me tell you the mall it's oh my god if y'all oh my god okay i'll just say it it was irving mall people that live here or you know know me y'all know what irving mall is it is the most worst place i'll put in those words <laughs> um there's weirdos there there's locals there like every time i used to go there i would see people i know and it would be just so annoying like i don't want to see you like basically like people from my school you know i just and then you gotta like talk to them and get like or i'll be like okay i'm gonna just look over here i've seen so many people i know and it's just so annoying it's so annoying hey guys right now i am editing I didn't see let me show you all editing. I forgot to mention, which is the biggest thing I wanted to mention in the video, was the also another reason why I don't like Irving Mall is because they don't even have a Forever 21 there. Like, what kind of mall doesn't have a Forever 21? So, that was another thing. And, like, a lot of people that know Irving Mall, like, y'all really can't, like, we can't find anything there, to be honest. Like, that's not a mall. Well, to me, in my opinion, that's not a mall I would go to shop. I would have to go to Grandvine or Parks Mall uh, or, like, just some other mall around here, like, in Dallas. But, like, I wouldn't go to Irving Mall because, you know, like, I can't find anything there for me. I don't know about the rest of people, but I feel like a lot of people would agree with me on that. And, like, maybe if they had a Fur 21 there maybe i would go there but like i said i just don't like going there because like you know people i would see people i know or like weirdos are there so i forgot to mention that but yeah hope you guys are enjoying hope y'all have your little snacks or whatever but yeah let's get back to the video but anyways um so we used to go there all the time just to like walk around shop eat you know what you know girls do at the mall whatever i tried telling the story one time but like i feel like i was all over the place so i didn't i decided not to upload it so this is me again second number well this is second that's up so I try my best not to be over the place but um so yeah we would used to go there all the time and this one time it was on sunday and they had this carnival they would do this carnival at um at the mall like every once I don't know, month, every once in two months, I don't know. But they would always put that carnival there. So uh, me and my best friend were like, we should go to the carnival or like whatever. So we decided to go there. And mind you, we went like at 12 in the afternoon. Like, and nobody was in, up in there. Like, it was just us two, literally. Literally, we were the only two people there. So I'm, I'm guessing like people go at night or whatever. I guess it's, it's more popular at night. We went there at 12. And we were literally the only two people. And y'all see this, like this is so good. Let me open the ranch more. Honestly, let me just, yeah, I was about, yeah, let's just take it off. And I got the buffalo, um, buffalo ranch, buffalo sauce because I wanted to try it with the cheese bread that I will in a sec or, uh, But yeah, um, so we went to the carnival, literally, us, the only two people there, I mean the workers were there, but it was just like us, the only people that was riding the rides. And, yeah, so, um, we got bored and like got hungry, so like, mind you, the mall is like next to the carnival, so, uh, we went inside the mall and we're like, we're going, I guess we went to the wood court, I believe. I don't remember what I ate, to be honest. I think like tacos from there, which they weren't bad. They were actually good. Cause I, like I said, the urban mall is like 
it's just i don't like that place i mean i don't like going there because like i see people i know or there just be weirdos there at this one time i was literally at, yeah i was in eighth grade i was like 13 or 14 years old and i think like i said me and my best friend used to go there all the time so i was with her and there's these two men um probably like in their 30s or mid 20s but they were ugly and you know i wasn't interested in working for anybody and like they was trying to like haul at us and like i felt uncomfortable because i wasn't wearing anything like you know revealing or it doesn't even matter what you wear but like like i just don't like that that's what i'm saying like there's weirdos there and then like there was like this one i remember it was like uh something that, that was happening there apparently um there was like a guy that um that used to go there and like like wait until women and get in the car so they can try to kidnap them like i read this story like it was like i don't know how long ago it was this like maybe like two three years ago so that's what i was like oh like y'all are weird like men weird but yeah they're just weird people <laughs> let me not say this it's not weird people it's weird men weird guys there older guys trying to like you know lots of little girls and plus i was 13 14 years old like do the math like <laughs> trying to catch a case but yeah <laughs> so yeah so we went into the mall looking for food i think i got tacos like i said well we got ta tacos and then we were just walking around and mind you it was a sunday and before i mean i don't know if they still do this i'm pretty sure but before coronavirus they would like close early on sundays for some reason they would close at six or like the rest of the, the rest of the days i think they close like at 10 i don't know like i'm not i i, I remember so um they close out they close early on sundays but we still went because i mean we weren't even thinking we just wanted to get food plus we were at the carnival and or the fair whatever you know you might no i'm really hungry <laughs> So yeah, I and mean, we stayed there until like, I think it was like around five-ish. I remember we were sitting down at this uh, like bench by the store inside the mall. And we were just like talking, taking selfies. <laughs> if I have videos, if I can find videos of us doing that, um, put them in, in this video so y'all can see like, you know. <laughs> So yeah, that's what we're doing. All of a sudden, I looked to my left because I was sitting at the bench and like I was like like this because my best friend was sitting over here, like beside me. So I was just like I had my body towards her, like over here. So I looked to my left. I see there's a guy, like across the I guess the hall, whatever, or across the room. So. I looked and I was just like, like to my best friend, like, why is he like standing over there? Like, he looks weird. Man, it just looked creepy. So he was like this, like, oh my God, let me show you. <laughs> he was like, I mean, you can't see my whole face, but he was like, since I turned left, he was like, um, kind of like this. But he was looking at something else. Like he had his hands on his waist and he was looking at something else. So he looked and that's when he started walking. So I was like, why is he coming over here? And my thing, we were the only two like people around that area. It was just us, like all the stores were closing. It was, excuse me. 
we were the only two people sitting at that bench like there was no one around us and it was just like you know that guy and so he started walking like fast walking so i was like no like i told my best friend like let's go like why is he coming over here and like i remember he was wearing a white shirt black pants he had glasses i think and he was like couldn't tell his like race but he looked lights again and he looked older so that's why i was like um like girl let's get up let's get up because why is he coming over here but we got on and we started running because like he started like not like running too but like fast like walking like so we got scared and we're like we literally got up and like ran <laughs> we taste the cheese bread let me show y'all again how it looks it's super yummy now am i supposed to cut this or just like Let's taste it with the buffalo sauce. Oh, I can't open it because my hands are like greasy. Okay, I'll open it. Okay, let's taste it. Taste test. They both taste good with the sauce and without it. It's good. Hold on, let me take another bite. This is actually good. This is my first time uh, trying this. Let me taste it. Domino, y'all really did something. I'm like, girl, get into the story of a whole lot of them. This is a monk bun, too. So, chill. This is better than Pizza Hut's um, cheese bread. Because Pizza Hut's cheese bread, I mean, it's good sometimes, but sometimes it's not. Like, they don't cook it, like, good. But it is. I will be getting this again. I'll recommend it, y'all. It tastes good. Well, everything tastes good, but this right here is mine. Oh, um, the girl on me sweat. Okay, I'm sorry. This is good. This is the cheesy bread. I got one, y'all. This is good. Good, good. saying good <laughs> okay so what was i saying i just wanted to try that but um what was i saying oh yeah so we started like like i said we got up from the bench and we started running like i literally almost tripped so there's this um there's like this little chain that says no trespassing i mean we went over it because like we we weren't the only people that do this i like like I said, like me and my best friend used to go there all the time. Uh, we would see people just go over it and like nobody says anything. So we went over it thinking of nothing. And we were like, after we like 
went over it like we went to the other side of the mall we started laughing and we we're like oh my god like why was he like coming to us like was he trying to kill us we just started laughing i remember i laughed so hard and then i turn around homeboy is behind us and he's giving us this dirty look and I read his shirt and it says security guards and I was like, oh, you a security guard, oh. So he was like, did y'all know what y'all just did? Y'all, y'all went over the chain and said no trespassing, you can't trust. I am so sorry y'all, I had to get more, more coke and more napkins. So anyways, like I was saying, so yeah, he was behind us. Well, yeah, he was behind us. And he was just like, yelling at us saying like y'all know what y'all just did um like y'all just trespassed you know you can get a ticket i can call your parents like we're just going like off on us so like i mean i didn't think anything was gonna happen i didn't know he was a security guard plus we did the right thing we started running because like um you was like kind of chasing us so my best friend was the one to talk first she was like um you were the one that like started like chasing us and we didn't know who you were like you, we don't know what you're trying to do like you could have been crazy or whatever and me agreeing i was like yeah like you were just like over there and like you looked at us and you started like like trying to like approach us and we got scared and we run off so we didn't think of anything of it. He was just like still going off saying, I can call your parents, da 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 da. And I was like thinking to myself like, sir, like you are a security guard. Like you really think you can get a promotion after this? Like calm down, like everybody does this. And I even said, I remember saying like, well, everybody goes over it. Like nobody says anything. So like, like he was just so mad. And I don't know what was <laughs> his problem that day, but like he needed to chill out. And then there was this other cop, uh, um, cop, security guard. And I guess he was the one that was yelling at us when he was black. And the other one, he was white. And he was like the chill one. He was like yelling at us. He, that's what he, the other cop, co I keep saying cop. Y'all are not cops, y'all are security guards. Anyways, so the other security guard started coming over there to like where we were. And we were by Burlington and yeah, so. He started like he was just there like like just like you know there and then that once he left i don't remember when the other security guard left i don't know what he said but yeah and then uh the the white security um guard he was like um it's okay guys y'all are like good um he was just having a bad day well he's having a bad day and i just don't do it again don't go over it like everything is good it's a warning just you know and also he was saying like um just go if you're gonna be here i suggest y'all to go by the movie theater that's where everybody is at and nobody's over here just so y'all can be safe so he was like more chill the the white security guard but the black security guard was just like going off on us and apparently he was having a bad day like okay okay you're having a bad day and you have to put it on us okay <laughs> yeah but he was doing the most like i don't know he was trying to get a promotion i don't know you don't like your job whatever but us just being like protective like we don't know what you were trying to do like you started like not running to us but like that's walking you, we don't know like you could have had a knife like Everybody does that. Like I, I always see people go over that little chain that says no trespassing. But I live a mess. And once I got home, I told my mom about it. She was like, "Why you didn't call me when it was happening?" And I was like, "Well, he was saying that he was gonna call a parent, so I, I was waiting for that call. But he never did." But like that's how I, once he walked off. I don't remember what he said, to be honest, because this happened so long ago. I told y'all I was in eighth grade. This happened like like five years ago. So y'all really remember? 
Oh, well, he's sad. But I remember the the other security guard was like more chill. He gave us a warning. He didn't give us a ticket. We were all good. But yeah, that's the time I was not arrested. Quotations because like he was doing the most. A little fool, to be honest. Um, y'all probably, <laughs> y'all probably seen like I didn't really eat that much, but like I literally take five bites, and I'm like, I'm full. Like I have a big appetite. Like y'all saw, um, y'all see I ordered pizza, cheese bread, and some wings. I only ate like three of them. Let me just eat one more, to be honest, and then maybe I'm done. What made me think about this one because I think I was um, going through my notes and I remember um, I wanted to do the story time like I told you I tried to do the story time one time but I feel like I was all over the place so I didn't upload it so like I said this is my second try and I, I feel like I will upload this I don't feel like I was all over my place on this plus I was um this is like a mug me so I made my post then. This is random, but I don't know if Pizza Hut wings or, I don't know which is better, Pizza Hut wings or Domino wings, I don't know, because I like Pizza Hut wings too. What do y'all think? Also, do you guys like my new intro, my new outro? I really work really hard on those. I hope you guys liked my new intro, my outro. I feel like this is the end of the video. I told the story. Marty getting cool. I'm gonna save it for later. I'm gonna take a bite of the cheese right now. <laughs> I keep saying I'm full, but I'm just over here eating. I think it's this one. No, these are the ones. Oh my god, shut up. I'm sorry if that's bothering me. Oh, this is really good. I suggest y'all get the cheese bread from Domino's. This is really good. This is better than the pizza like I said. It's really good. It's like warm now, but it was good when it was hot. I mean, it feels good, but... I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, give it a big fat thumbs up. I'm sorry if you see Kirina. It is the eye so hair. Uh, make sure you hit that subscribe button so you can become the angel gang. Make sure you put your post notifications on so that will let you know when I post a new video. And yeah, pretty much it. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video me eating and giving a little story time about, about me getting arrested. Almost. Didn't happen. I'm, it was just something over stupid. Like that security guard was doing the most. I was 13, 14 years old, like, what can you do? Everybody does that, like, I just, ugh. Anyway, but yeah, he was saying his job, too, seriously. But anyways, I'll see you guys in the next video. Love you guys so much. I can't reach it, but we're gonna pretend I reached it. Bye, y'all.